All right. Hey folks, Nathan here. This is my channel. My name is Nathan P. Butler, and this channel has usually about, oh, I'd say about 700 different videos on it as of right now, uh, the vast, vast majority of which are Star Wars games uh, or other Star Wars-related content here. Uh, but I've had the opportunity here to pick up a PlayStation VR, and with a Star Wars VR mission coming for Battlefront, I'm doing some Let's Plays of the initial parts uh, or some representative parts, I guess, of a lot of different PlayStation VR games that I've picked up. So you can see what it's like, decide whether to buy a PlayStation VR system, and so on and so on. And just decide whether or not to buy any of these games. This is an interesting one this time, because uh, this is actually a game that I wasn't planning on buying at first, but it was like less than five bucks. I barely even know what it's about. It's called O, that is the letter O exclamation point, My Goddess. Interesting. Let me get my headphones in for the full experience here. I knew I was forgetting something. Oh, it's so hard to see anything when you're wearing this thing. One of the games that uses the, uh, or can use the PlayStation Move motion controllers, which is awesome, and I love these. These cartoony-esque gloves. Those are pretty badass looking. Awesome. Awesome power. Okay. Haven't done anything yet, so we got options, we got new. What, what, what kind of options we got? Background music, which is a little high. Voice, Let's go. sound effects. Let's go! Okay! Let's go. Okay! Sure, why not? I like this menu system though, just reach into the orb and click it. So far, I am impressed at least by their menu presentation. Lots of slots. We'll do this one. I'm reaching forward and grabbing it. This feels cool. I don't know what this game's gonna be like, but so far it feels nice. I like it, and that's very cutesy. I'm assuming this is kind of a cartoony type game. Again, it's less than five bucks, or was less than five bucks on PlayStation Network, so how could I miss getting a new VR experience that was less than five bucks? PlayStation VR has very much changed the way that I play games. Whoa! Okay. Oh, look what we have. A uh, new creator hello? of the universe? I guess. Looks pretty good. I am uh, God not here. quite there yet. Lawn Mower Man, virtual reality joke. I'm Phoebe, fairy of the galaxy, the greatest Hi. mentor in the universe. Hey, what's Phoebe, up with that look? Phoebe, All the creators Phoebe, I've ever Phoebe. taught are now Pantheon rock stars and do a superb job in their respective part of the universe. No pressure. Just Pantheon saying. rock stars. I mean, it's like the Norse god. As a creator, guys your from number one mission Alan is to Wake. protect those who live on the planet from harm of their natural enemies. You have to help them develop their civilization Ooh, slap my and balls increase together their population. By accident. Can't get to, this is as close as you can get because the balls hey, will touch. Hey, stay awake. Does this make sense? Yes. Yes. As a beginner, you need to be challenged. After you pass the trial, you can goof off on your own and become a creator. Okay. First, let's look at this. Okay. What we got? This panel board will show the missions you need to complete. Cool. When you reach 100%, that means you have passed the test for this planet. Okay. Now let me introduce the alleys who live on this planet. They what? may look clumsy, but they're very nice and friendly. Uh, seems like they're all hiding behind the planet. Oh, is this because I'm too pretty to look at? So we have a typical... Try to touch the planet with your hands uh, and press the T button to bad rotate Asian the planet dub. to find the alleys. The English doesn't match the mouth and the mouth keeps moving after the, the words are done. And really poor voice acting so far. Oh, oh, it's showing me. That's kind of cool. It's giving you like a... You hold up your hands and you know that that's what you're holding up with the move controls, but it's showing the move controllers a few inches above where your hand would be telling you what to do. That's cool. Oh, that's neat. I like that. Yay, like that them. manipulation. Look at these little guys waving to you. Aren't they you just can use adorable? both hands? Cool. Hi. We finished the first mission on this planet, finding the owlies. Owlies? When you've completed a mission, a star will appear on top of the planet. The number of stars represents the number of missions you've completed. Okay. Oh, I'm doing a fine job as a mentor. Oh. <laughs> uh -oh. Look, okay. a totem just appeared. Okay. Altars are being set up around the totem. Activating the totem will bring you new power, but how to do it? 
Let me guess. It's Grab easy. It. Use your index finger and thumb There's to the press sun. and hold the T button and the move button to pinch an alley and place him on the altar. Okay, so we got grip Through alley or sincere worshiping, pinch. You will be able to gain nice. power. So... <laughs> okay, that's marginally adorable. Good job. We finished another mission and gained the power of rain. Rain! See those little sprouts on the ground? Place your hand on top of the sprouts. Use your thumb to press and hold the move button to release your power. Make it rain up in here! Fantastic! We must have rain for plants to grow. But be careful! There are limits to your divine power. Look at your wrist. It tracks the remaining power you still have. Huh. Even though you'll regain your power slowly, don't abuse it. Huh. See? That is... There's something on Ali's head. It's a thinking bubble that represents the creature's need, and it looks like they need your help. Observe the bubble carefully, then take Ali to the location specified in the bubble. She needs to go to the forest. Dude. And of course, this is all feels like it's a couple feet in front of me. Almost like beach ball size. Oh, Ali seems to be building something. Could it be a statue for me? Nifty. Wait, oh yeah, you already got the... Yeah, plenty of rain. Oh, I can start new that raindrops. Not for me, but for you, beginner level creator. I see how it Let me is. See this. Bunch of small creatures trying to find uh, their new creator. Hmm. Well, it's a lot like me, except for the hair. You know, just saying. It looks like you now have a basic idea of what it means to be a creator. Boom, 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 boom. Now let's move towards another planet. It will be your next challenge. Burn. Three. Or as you might two, say. One. Let's go. Okay. Or you could do the, the Bill Clinton thing. I feel your pain and your boobies. Or it could be Trump, but I'm not going to show that gesture just now. My hands have disappeared because it's loading. What do I do? Oh, my Genesis. You know, it has nothing to do with Sega. Although, you know, Genesis, Sega. All right, the loading screen kind of stinks because you don't get a sense that it's making any progress. It's just kind of there. All right, bring it. Phew! Yay, we arrived planet. safe and sound at the Ali's original world. Sweet. There will be more difficult challenges on this planet, and Ali's natural enemy will appear from time to time. Ooh, water. It's your job to protect these little guys while developing their civilization. Okay. A Thank totem you. just appeared. Remember how to activate it? Yes. Sort of. This one needs water, doesn't it? Do I remember how to activate it? Uh, I thought I'd get up above and I hit the... Oh, no, I grabbed somebody. Great! Now let's help Ali build their villages. He needs to get to the rock, I guess. Yep. <laughs> Alright, is there a forest? No, I'm gonna need to sprout something. I can remember where to... Okay, that's a different kind of tree. Ah, there's the right kind of tree. I'm not having to turn them into, like, lumberjacks or anything. It's just being there that's doing it, apparently. Alright. Well done! Ooh. This is Ali's first home. Oh, so it's love. I want to fall in love too. Oh. <laughs> love shack, baby, love shack. Yeah. Little baby Ali. That was quick. <laughs> so cute. As the population increases, Ali will build new houses. All right. Oh! Get back up here. You don't want to die. All right. So, dude needs me to find him a. Uh,
rainbow. Where's the other one? Up, oh, get out of the water! If you drown, I am no longer gonna be your god. Alright, she wants to go here? Nope, that's not it. Alright, this is like the evil side of the planet. I guess I need to grow more stuff with my water? Why do you keep. Why do you idiots keep going in the water? Where's your teeny tiny? Who seems to want to go to something. Aha! Yes? Yes? What does he want? He wants some kind of. Huh. Make it rain up in here. Alright, so those become that. Ah, there it is. Okay, come here. Right there. Get back. Oh, okay, so that eating those makes them turn into adults. Get back here, teeny tiny. Huh. Crazy. Uh oh. oh no. Meteorites are coming from outer space. You see the tracks that shows incoming strikes? Yes. Hurry! Use your hands to block them. That's a good job. Oh, that's cool. I like that. Leave my people alone! Oh shit, and I missed one. Okay, that was interesting. Huh. This is crazy and yet very cool at the same time. It's goofy and kitty, and I would not have thought that I would have enjoyed this, but this is actually pretty cool, being able to manipulate it with your hands in front of you. If this was a traditional game with a DualShock 4 controller, I'm not sure I would have given a crap. But, yeah. What are you smacking there, son? Oh, he's building a thingy. Cool. What do you guys need now? Whoop, what do you need? You need some rocky stuff. A new totem has appeared. Locate and activate it as fast as possible. Hi -ya, hi -ya, hi -ya, hi -ya. Oh, they're gonna go get it on again. Yay! You just gained a new power. Okay. Press any action button to switch your divine power. So I got rain or wind, I guess this is. Figure out what that guy wants. I guess he wants one of these, maybe? I doubt it. But let's find out. Come here. Is this what you want? No? Get back with your people. The stones seem to be covered by sand. Your wind power will help reveal ah, this resource go. to the alleys. Ah. Oh shit! Meteor! Where's the dude that needs the... Where are you at? Or are you done? You don't need it anymore. Get up here. Stop getting in the water! You! He's like a miner. I keep being afraid that those fish or something are going to eat them. Or they're going to drown. This 
this is rather amusing. Oh, more guys going bow. Chicken bow bow. Bow, chicken bow bow. All right, I need a teeny tiny over. Stinky flowers are incoming. Ew, something smells strange. Man, it's the stinky flowers. Okay. Their poisonous stinky gas will hurt the alleys. Do something. Uh oh. Look, there's a new holy artifact. Here you go. Let Ali fix the holy artifact so you can use it. Fix the holy artifact? Uh. with these things. I want to destroy those things, but I don't know how. I apparently have a teeny tiny down there that needs... Come here. guys just died, I guess. Oh! It seems like all I can do is just spin them around. What do you need, son? You need some kind of red firewoodish stuff. That? These plants, I don't like them. I can't grab them and move them. I need to spin them around so they're not messing with my dudes. Now you've got the holy torch. Pick it up and give it a try. But remember what Mother Nature always says. Don't play with fire. Die! Perfect. Now Allie knows how to defend themselves against the stinky flower. Okay. Two other things to do, looks like. Dinosaur. What? Dinosaurs are coming. This is not Robinson huh? the Journey. Something seems to be on the move. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. A new natural enemy just showed up. This dinosaur seems to eat meat. Get Allie as far away from the dinosaur as possible. How did you? It's a new holy artifact. Hurry up and get it fixed. I mean, hurry up. I just stuck him over there. Ah, there he is. Here, fix it.
Aha! He's stuck on the plant! Alright, what's he need? He needs that. Here. Right here. He needs a... What? What is that purple thing that he needs? I don't know what he needs. A purple what? Oh, somebody just died at the hands of the friggin'... No. Get them! Right back off him! Get off him, you bastard! sure what homeboy there needs. What am I looking for? He needs that, but what is that? It's almost like a meteor or something. Buddy. Okay. Yeah, I don't know what the dude he okay, little tiny, I know what little tiny dude needs. There it is. There it is, there it is, there it is. Where's Teeny Tiny? Oh, he just ate the Teeny Tiny one. Alright, where's my dude that needs the thingy? Where is he? Shit! Here. This way. Come on, bitch. Where's it at? Where's it at? Where's it at? I just saw it. Uh, I just saw the little purple thing. There. Here. Take it. Sorry, homie. Come on. Okay. Aim the blow dart at the target, then press the move button to use it. Oh, nice. Okay, that's pretty neat. Do you want to try a dinosaur? I so want to try it as well. Okay. Is that it? Because I can't manipulate anything anymore. My hands aren't showing up anymore. Congratulations! Allie's planet has been saved thanks to you. Nice. As a beginner level god, you did pretty well. No wonder you were taught by me. Just a couple things I didn't manage to do. Let's go to the next planet. Whoa! That was...
was the way to the next planet. Something doesn't feel right. Hurry, go check what's going on. Okay. New planet's coming soon. Wait, all missions to unlock Apocalypse. Well, maybe that explains why the game is relatively cheap. Because there's only the one planet. And more planets will be coming soon. That actually is pretty cool, though. Again, I would not have gotten into it playing that on a traditional uh, system. So, planet Nanu, planet Dreen, coming soon, coming soon. Okay. Huh. So I could go back to Doran and try to do those things that I didn't do. That's kind of nice. Um, granted, it feels more like a demo from a game length perspective, but what can you expect for less than five bucks? I definitely think this was a cool one to check out. Um, I'm actually going to keep this on the system and go back to it whenever new planets are released. That was pretty cool. Uh, Alright, so, uh, coming up, more PlayStation VR Let's Plays of some initial parts, uh, including stuff like Space Rift and whatnot. Thank you for watching, and uh, please subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Have a good one.